and welcome back to another edition of History in Your Own Backyard. I'm Satoli. Today we're in Rush County, Indiana, and we're going to check out the six remaining covered bridges still standing in the county today. Come on, let's check it out. Over the years, Rush County, Indiana has been home to at least 23 covered bridges. Many of these bridges have been lost due to floods, arson, storms, and progress. Let's take a look at the six remaining bridges and the family who built these historic structures that are still used on a daily basis. Archibald McMichael Kennedy began working as a carpenter in 1841. In 1864, he built this home northeast of Rushville for his family. Later, it was listed on the National Register of Historic Places in 1983. Kennedy began building covered bridges in 1870 when he won a contract to build their first covered bridge over the East Fork of the Whitewater River in Union County, Indiana. Archibald's two sons, Emmett L. Kennedy and Charles Kennedy, both joined their father in the covered bridge building business in 1871. At least 58 cover bridges were built by the Kennedy firm, which eventually included his grandsons Carl and Charles R. The last Kennedy cover bridge, the Norris Ford, was constructed in 1916 and still stands today 101 years later. The Smith Cover Bridge is located on East 150 North, northeast of Rushville. The bridge was built in 1877 and is 124 feet long and spans the Flat Rock River. It was damaged by an arsonist in 1988 and restored in 1995. The Norris Ford Cover Bridge is located on East 300 North, also northeast of Rushville. The bridge was built in 1916, is 154 feet long, and spans the Flat Rock River. It was named after Oliver Norris, who owned a nearby farm and was added to the National Register of Historic Places in 1993. The bridge was restored in 2000. The Ophitz Ford Cover Bridge is located on Ophit Bridge Road near Arlington. The bridge was built in 1884, is 82 feet long, and spans the Little Blue River. In the 1980s, it was closed due to its poor condition, and then, in 1995, it was torched by an arsonist. At the time, much discussion was given to whether it should be restored or replaced, and thankfully, it was restored. Today, a small park with benches can be found on the south side of the bridge where you can enjoy a picnic next to the beautiful bridge and the river. It was added to the National Register of Historic Places in 1983. Forsyth Mill Cover Bridge is located on West 650 South near Milroy. The bridge was built in 1888, is 182 feet long, and spans the Flat Rock River. It was also added to the National Register of Historic Places in 1983.
The Moscow Covered Bridge is located in the town of Moscow and has an interesting history. Built in 1886, the bridge is 345 feet long and spans the Flat Rock River. This is the third longest covered bridge in the state of Indiana. The bridge was closed in the early 1980s due to deterioration but was repaired and reopened. Unfortunately, on June 3, 2008, the bridge took a direct hit from an F3 tornado and was toppled into the river below. Plans were made almost immediately to save and rebuild the historic structure. On September 2010, the Moscow Cover Bridge was reopened and once again can be enjoyed by anyone visiting the village of Moscow. This is the only double span bridge built by the Kennedy firm that is still standing today. The Homer Barn Cover Bridge was located on West 255 South in the town of Homer. It was built in 1881 and originally spanned Mud Creek. In 1892, the bridge was engulfed in a massive flood, washed off its bridge abutments and floated downstream where it ended up in a farmer's field and was then converted into a barn. Falling apart from years of neglect, the bridge was dismantled and transported to the Pioneer Engineers Club about five miles away where it was rebuilt and restored. Today, the bridge is no longer open to vehicular traffic, but is now used as a footbridge in this park-like setting.
thanks for watching another edition of History in Your Own Backyard. Today we were in Rush County, Indiana, checking out the six remaining covered bridges still standing in the county. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember, travel slowly and stop often. We'll see you next time. Bye. <music>